everybody, it's Chris with Sound Devices, and I'm here to talk to you about doing the plug-in uh, installation on your MixPre 3, 6, and 10T. And plug-in installation at this point uh, would be the plug-in available, which is the Musician's plug-in. That will allow you to have uh, overdubbing, reverb, air, and all kinds of other fancy features that we've designed into the MixPre 3M, 6M, and 10M. It'll allow you to have those. So we're going to go through actually setting that up, downloading it from the store, getting it installed. All right, the first step in getting a hold of the plugin is to navigate to www.sounddevices.com. And once you get on our website, navigate to the store. You're going to find uh, right now we have the Musician plugin available there. At that point, it's going to ask you for your device's serial number so that you can check compatibility. So with the serial number, you can easily find that on the back of your unit right next to the SD card slot. And the way that the plugin works is it's, it's registered only to work on that particular serial number unit. So if you need it for more than one unit, you will have to purchase the plugin for each unit and enter each unit's serial number. With that said, I'm going to enter in my serial number. I'm going to hit the check button next to it, which then takes me to a new screen that allows me to, it says that I can in fact, use that plugin and buy it. So I will buy it. I will hit the buy button and then go to the cart by hitting the button that says view cart. And then I see my cart total, which is $99 for the musician plugin. And I will proceed to checkout by clicking on that button. It says order received, gives me a confirmation with details. And then at the bottom of that page, I get a option to download device licenses. I'm going to click on that number and that gives me the license download link and boom, it downloads to my machine. So that's the file that you want to transfer to your SD card. And you can do that either by inserting the SD card into your computer if it has a built-in slot or a separate uh, device hooked up to your computer. Uh, in my case, we're actually going to do it via file transfer because I have a cable connected to the MixPre. Okay, so in order for me to transfer the license file onto the MixPre 6, I'm going to go into file transfer mode by tapping on the top right hand menu button and then continuing tapping till I get to the system menu. And then I'm going to hit the file transfer button. Now I should be able to see my MixPre 6's SD card on my Mac. And I'm simply going to grab a hold of that musician plugin.lic file that I downloaded from the Sound Devices website. And I'm going to drag it right into the MixPre SD card. And my happy Mac gives me that sound that it's done the job. I will then eject that from my Mac and I will exit out of file transfer mode. Once that's done, I should be able to continue through the system menu to find the plugin option. And I can first of all show plugins and there's no plugins found on this because this is just a standard MixPre 6. So I'm going to hit OK and I'm going to actually apply plugins. So now it's going to look on the SD card for the plugin. It found it and it applied it. So now I'm going to hit OK. Plugins applied. It's going to restart. In order to use it, you will have to access it through creating a new project. And you'll come up with this screen where now all of a sudden you can create an audio project, which is using the unit in the standard um, MixPre 6 method or you will create a new music project by clicking on the music notes. In that point, at that point, you can create a song name, you choose your sample rate, import recording or create, and you go forward. That opens up the door to all these new features and all that new functionality. So by all means, go experiment, have fun, and create music. Thanks.